are also launching a new course on organizing um, organizing um, strengthening our capacity organizing in trade unions in this changing world of work we know there are changes and we need to change in formal sector uh, as we graduate it also to become more formal than it is so you join me in this launch uh, all of these members are going to recruit in this course uh, by the count of th uh, three, we'll cut the cake. Uh, one, two, three. Yay! 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 So this course is officially launched. Thank you. Oh, oh, oh. Thank you very much, Madam. Thank you very much, everyone. Uh, I think we will have the password to leave this place. We need to go through the signing process. So uh, we should have our phones because we are launching an online a communication. Yeah. That means if we have our phones at hand, that is. I'm Namrembe Agatha Arembe, Chairperson Uganda Public Employees Union. Uh, today we are launching our online training. As you know, the world of work has changed so much. Uh, we can no longer converge to have face-to-face uh, uh, -face trainings, face-to-face -face meetings, and so on. So what ILO has done, especially the workers' desk, is to introduce e-learning. So starting from last year, September, there have been training uh, people who would be trainers on the e-learning platform. Uganda benefited, there were three of us who attended those trainings. Uh, Jessica Mujuka of Markets Union, uh, Frank Mugaya, Transport Union, and myself, Namirembe Agatha, Uganda Public Employees Union. We have been trained to do e-learning courses, to design our courses, and also to run them. And at the end of the day, give out certificates, which are internationally recognized. This is a, a, a program of ILO. Uh, at uh, the workers' desk. And we are very grateful for our brother, Mamazingo Muhammad, who championed these trainings. And the, we are the pilot group of East African countries that include Kenya, Tanzania, Rwanda, Uganda, and Zanzibar. So those were the participants that we had on our training. We want to bring workers' education nearer to you, where people can use even their smartphones to do trainings wherever they are. So that is the basic concept. You can learn online at your own pace in your free time from the comfort of your homes. During your free time, if you have free time, log into these courses. They have gone a very, very long mile in helping us. Today we are launching a course on strengthening the capacity of organizing in trade unions in this changing world of work. So that's why we have converged here today. We have launched that course which starts today and it's going on in all the East African countries. Please join us. If you see us advertising, take advantage. We want all unions to also benefit you can organize, you can train, you can sensitize, you know, you can recruit, you can carry out any kind of a campaign using these e-learning platforms. And we are here to assist and help. If you need our assistance, if you need to join the courses, please don't hesitate to contact us. Each one of us was supposed to design an individual course. I designed one in occupational health and safety for those practicing occupational health and safety. Then Jessica designs one for negotiations in the informal settings, uh, in the public places. Those are the courses that have been running, designed by us and designed by ourselves. And actually, people have already got certificates in them. Even today, we are able to give out five certificates for people who have been able to complete these courses. As I said, these courses you can uh, follow them up and learn at your own pace. 
so it's not uh, a set time frame at your own pace when you get time we have had participants from arua from kisoro kabale uh, moroto all over the place who have participated uh, but today's course is targeting our own unions and uh, we are looking at those people who are involved in organizing so this course this is the first part but it will be uh, being run so if you want to join us please our next intake will have to broadcast it out and you'll have to join and join from all over wherever you are you can still join these are internationally recognized courses as i told you and the certificates are also internationally recognized there are no expenses as per involved these courses are very free they are free courses what you only need to have is maybe a connection an internet connection you can use wi-fi but you can also use your data so data is where you only spend so instead of using your uh, phones for whatsapp and facebook you can use that data wisely to broaden your knowledge. I'm called Mujuka Jessica and I'm the Deputy General Secretary of Uganda Markets and Allied Employees Union and the Council of Workers in Barara City and I represent workers in informal economy at the National Organization of Trade Unions, that is NOTO. Uh, today we've launched e-learning and digital communications purposely for workers in informal economy network. Uh, these are courses whereby I was trained and I have a certificate to design those courses on the site and then give different participants who are interested they can uh, register and log into that site. Uh, we, we, after training, we were trained by uh, IFWEA, International Federation of Workers uh, Association, uh, which is based in South Africa and after the training they gave us a site for free. These sites are just like uh, websites. If you, ha you want to, uh, to design one, you buy it and it's so expensive to maintain. But at this moment, uh, if we are managed to give us a site after the training, so I designed a course of which I gave uh, my, 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 my members in the informal economy or in the informal sector different informal sectors not only markets union because we have even artists we have fisheries we have uh, different uh, informal workers so they did a, a course and finished it it was about collective negotiations on public working spaces in informal economy of which we saw it's uh, the diff a, a most challenging situation in informal workers where they don't always uh, have uh, 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 designated working spaces who are officially uh, given to them. All the time they are on run, run here and there. Their, good, their goods are being confiscated, they are being imprisoned with the police and they are, so we, 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 we decided to put that course and see how we can negotiate with the authorities to be given those working spaces and we can settle there uh, with no any other inter interference. Now these are two things. There is e-learning and then there, is, there are these courses. These courses are like any other courses that we have been going into in classes or in halls like as I think here and get trainings or like we take three days in a workshop face to face. But an advantage here is like everything is digital. We go online, we design wherever you are at any given time, you're not interrupted. At you get time, you, you, you go to the site, you get training very well using the materials that are logged on the site. So there are different trainings and even uh, right now we have another training that's going to start about capacity building. So it depends on which, uh, uh, which course you want to design and put on the platform. The advantage of it and why we're introducing it is one, uh, not even one, is like uh, uh, the world is going digital. We've been not uh, getting a time or uh, enough funds to go in the field, one, recruiting our members and uh, funds to uh, bring them together for trainings. But now we give them, send them links through WhatsApp and then they log into the site. They got that school. After logging to that school, they find each and every training materials on that site and they start reading as, um, uh, um, uh, 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 as an educator as I'm directing them, uh, directing them in each and everything. 
Uh, we, uh, the, the finished course, we had uh, 20 participants, but at this moment, uh, they added, uh, we, we, we got 32 participants in this second course of uh, capacity building. And we have uh, different participants from uh, Arua, uh, from uh, Telego, from Barara, and in Kampala, as per now. No, and and, 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 and um, Fort Potro. That's where we had managed to get participants at this moment. But still, we shall keep on widening the scope to get participants more, more, and more. And um, in a special way, I want to thank the, the market union and the entire team. You know, when, we, when I purchase vehicles, I have a challenge because most of the time the vehicles normally the budget will go low because they are packed, they are not using them. But the market union has actually tried several times. You can ask for them. One time the team went and went to Northern. They said to the chairman went to another team, Western. I'm still waiting for you. Let me tell you one thing. We either change or we die. We either change or we do what? Yeah. We die. The only feature for the labor movement is to ensure that we organize. You speak for normal and say, why does the interior engage? Even if you say your head is like a, a ball and not mine. After all, it's my head. I don't engage in the petty, petty things, petty, petty quarrels. Because that's not my price, that's not my level. How do you ever tell them to be an engagement? You already fight. Will I tell them to be? You did one thing, you pushed me up. So I must rebrand myself and be trendy. So the only thing I can do is support you with bigger things. Critical thinking. Not this business of what has they, what has just said, what have they said about so if you said about all that. So what? I don't have that time. I think most of the time I'm looking for opportunities. So that we move. Because the only time I count is today, not even tomorrow. You get the point? Yes. Only today is the day I count. So I, today, what will you count over me to have achieved? You know that change in the positive direction, ladies and gentlemen. So what I want to tell you is that one less away the petty car, petty fights. And ensure that we really take on serious things. Because at the end of the day, if you are going to tell people, if your children are going to ask you, that, what did you do? And you say, yeah, I was driving Porsche the cars. Then one, one by one will be going now. So you are going to cars, where are they now? So we must rebrand and ensure that we make things that are trendy. For me, that's my, my, my place, my spirit. I want that to be changed. Whenever I get an opportunity, I will ask me, yeah, okay, sir, do you have an opportunity? Whenever I get an opportunity, I will send to Wanyama. Not whether we competed in elections, that was history. <laughs> it's now time to do what perform. Mr. Eh? John, what do I know I'm telling you? Can you find this opportunity? Those, those are the issues. I said, let's, let's reach our, our colleagues opportunities. Let's show people opportunities. Otherwise, this is basically cash price and not a going to help us. And I want to ask the market union, the getting with the union, to ensure that if we are going wrong, tell us, much as the RMP, much as I'm a leader, I'm a general secretary, but this is not so important. If we keep quiet about, the challenge is when we keep quiet about and look at the facts and fear of them, then we shall never have an institution called the Paparanamity, ladies and gentlemen. So I want to encourage you, really embrace this, because they say success has got so many good fathers, whereas failure is an orphan. You clap for Jessica now. <laughs> Things have changed. Even you have matters in the court, even people are using evidence via, via, I mean, online. So it is a way to go. And I don't know. There's a way she does her things. She gets them moving. Let us clap for her in She has rescued so many people who are in the Arab world. Are you aware of that? She gets things moving. And Mr. Chairman, I guess so more than that. And the whole level MOP, let us support. Congratulations. So, congratulations. Please go and use this information wisely and continue learning. So you are seeing 
to take this knowledge to Arua. We know how far Arua is, but uh, we are happy that the networks have been enabled us to go that far. Thank you. So congratulations, Jackie. As we see, uh, these trainings are for all of us. In whatever field, you can get a training. And you will be a jack of all trades. That is the most important thing with e-learning. Mm -hmm. You can even...